Do you think you could go pro in Fortnite? If so, answer these questions to find out. What's faster, using one striker pump or two strikers with delay pumps? Using two is the correct answer. So basically double pumping, since it's back in the game at the moment. And it's way faster than using one striker pump, since this gun shoots so slowly. And I hope they don't patch the double pump. Now which one of these skins is the rock behind? The foundation or the scientist? Hopefully you said the foundation, since we literally just saw him in the live event. Then he's honestly one of the most hyped up skins at the moment. But there's also someone famous behind the scientist, which is pretty cool to me. But which one of these locations isn't on the Fortnite Chapter 3 map? Butter Barn, Rocky Reels, or Paradise Palm? Paradise Palms isn't on the map, but not gonna lie, if you ask me, it looks like it is, since they made Condo Canyon really basically identical to it. Then true or false? Chinese users have access to Fortnite Chapter 3. Sadly, it's false. They don't have access to Fortnite at all anymore since Fortnite legit ended Fortnite China. Which honestly sucks for them and for us because they had so many cool things in their version of Fortnite that could have been good for us. Like, um, maybe free V-Bucks epic? And true or false, Fortnite bolted all the guns from previous seasons in Chapter 3 except for two. Yep, that's actually true. We have a whole brand new loot pool now that feels so different because I'm still stuck trying to learn how to work the pumps. Then the only items we still have from older seasons are the Boom Sniper and Hop Rock Duelies. And it sucks that buying them costs way too much gold. But speaking of money, how much did Booga get paid for winning the World Cup? $500,000, a million, or three million? And three million dollars is your answer. And I know I'm not the only one who would love to see another World Cup sometime in Chapter 3, since we didn't get anything like that in Chapter 2. And if you knew that one, you have to know how many points you need to reach the Champions League. Is it 5,000, 7,500, or 10,000? 7,500 is your answer. And yeah, not gonna lie, I won't be getting that anytime soon, but I'll probably get eliminated 7,500 times if I try grinding arena. And that's easy compared to one question that's coming up in a few minutes that only about three people watching the video I think will be able to answer. But first, how much health does a dark blue mushroom give you? 0 HP, 1, or 5 HP? Zero health, silly, since these dark blue mushrooms only give you player shield. And it's so annoying finding these when you do need health. Then these aren't those light blue slurp mushrooms. But true or false, Booga is the only Fortnite pro with his own Fortnite item. False! I mean, he's the only Fortnite pro with his own Icon series skin in Fortnite, but he isn't the only one with an item. Because we couldn't forget about my man Benji Fishy and the Siren which is personally better than Booga's skin to me, don't tell anyone, then there are a few more pros with bundles as well. True or false, Tilted Towers is on the Chapter 3 island. Yeah, that's true. It's currently frozen, but it indeed is on the island. And I know we all can't wait for it to unfreeze since there's currently no hot drop in the game at the moment. So, you know, hurry up and unfreeze, Tilted. And do you know how long the FNCS winners keep the Axe of Champions? Is it forever, for the entire chapter, or until the next FNCS? They keep it until the next FNCS, proving that only the best players at the time own this pickaxe. And has anyone even spotted someone using this pickaxe? But I honestly wouldn't want to because of how sweaty they would be. Then which one of these items was secretly in the Fortnite Chapter 3 live event? The Zapatron or the MK7 Assault Rifle? The Zapatron is your answer. Because if you stayed in the downtime screen long enough, you would have seen debris floating by, and one of those was a Zapatron. So hopefully Epic brings this thing back this season. It's literally ancient at this point. Uh, but true or false, the shakedown feature has been removed. Yep, that's true. Finally, we don't have to worry about picking up a player and shaking them down by accident and getting eliminated. I know we all hated that, right? But the questions get harder and harder as we go on because now, what season did the World Cup occur in? Season eight, season nine, or season X? Season nine is your answer. I'm not gonna lie, feels like Season X, and that's probably because the season straight up ended two or three days after the World Cup was over. And I know every Fortnite pro got this one right, but can you get this one right? How many selectable styles of Spider-Man are there? One, two, three, or four. There are three selectable styles of him, because you have the classic style, then the all black, and the all white. Symbiote and Future Foundation, respectively. But let's hope they release another Spider-Man variation into the shop sometime soon. Since, I know, we all saw the Miles Morales Easter egg at the Daily Bugle. But what do you have to do to play in the FNCS? 
get an invite from Fortnite, or reach Champions League. Simple! Just reach the Champions League and you'll be able to play in the FNCS. But still, I'd probably have a better chance of playing in it if you just had to get an invitation from Fortnite, to be honest. And do you know which one of these skins was made by a fan of Fortnite? Lieutenant John Llama or Haven? Answer, Lieutenant John Llama. It was made by Pulso Draws. And if you can head over to page 3 on the Battle Pass, you'll be able to find this skin. And you can't tell me it doesn't look fire, especially the second style. Then while talking about Chapter 3, do you know how many Chapter 1 POIs Fortnite's bringing back to Chapter 3? 4, 5, or 10? It's 5, because you have Greasy Grove, Loot Lake, Shifty Shaft, Sunny Steps, and Tilted Towers whenever it melts. And am I the only one who completely forgot about Sunny Steps until seeing it again? Now which of these things can get you banned in Fortnite? Pickaxe swinging or shield dropping? Pickaxe swinging can, since some players in Arena had started doing this to let other players know that they were not trying to fight at the moment. That way they could rotate to the zone. And I don't even know anyone who'd want to drop shield. <laughs> How many FNCS skins are there at the start of Fortnite Chapter 3? 2, 3, or 4? There are three at the moment, because you have Victor Elite, Major Glory, a skin that I'm kind of mad I didn't buy, and you also have the Champion. But it would be cool if the FNCS skin released during Chapter 3 had a different look, since the two of them are almost the same. Then in a little, there's one question that might make you frustrated when trying to answer it. But first, which item would you choose? One Med Mist, or one Med Kit? Hopefully you said one Med Kit, or Medi Betty. That's a f***ing Medi Betty. A med kit. Because if you want to go pro, you would have chosen this since the medkit gets you to 100 health way faster than a med mist. Who is the founder of Fortnite? Donald Mustard or Tim Sweeney? Tim Sweeney is the founder, and I feel like this might have been a trick question for some since everyone hears about Donald all the time, but he still is one of the CEOs, he's just not the founder of the game. True or false? A llama spawns at Lieutenant John's cabin every game. Yeah, that's true. You can reliably find yourself a llama at Lieutenant John's cabin. And if you don't know where this is, it's south of Logjam Lumberyard. But I wouldn't recommend you land there without looting since llamas love running away now. What engine does Fortnite run on? Unity, Unreal, or Ubisoft? Fortnite runs on Unreal Engine, and they recently moved to Unreal Engine 5 for Chapter 3, which is so good. Because that's probably the reason we have the sliding mechanics and the new overpowered trees that you can use for nearly everything. Now, which gun did Fortnite bring back for the unvaulting event? The TAC SMG, Scoped AR, or Drum Gun? Hopefully you said Drum Gun. I'm sure everyone knew that one, but you won't know the next one. Now, the TAC SMG, though, was an option that players could have voted to unvault, and thankfully, the Infinity Blade didn't win. True or false? The first member of the Seven was released in Season 3. Nope, that's false. The first one was released in Season 4 because the Visitor was the first member of the Seven. And he was the secret skin in the Season 4 Battle Pass. Only OGs will remember how crazy it was trying to get this skin. How many different styles of the default skins are there? One, two, or three? There are three. Because you have the OG Chapter 1 default skins, aka the best ones. Then you have the Chapter 2 and Chapter 3 default skins. And I wonder if Fortnite will release those in the item shop as well. What was the first season Fortnite banned superhero skins in? Chapter 2 Season 4 or Chapter 2 Season 5? They banned them in Chapter 2 Season 5 because they were first released in Chapter 2 Season 4. And that was when you'd see almost 90% of the arena lobby wearing the all black or white superhero skin. Which day of the week did Chapter 3 start on? Saturday, Sunday, or Wednesday? Hopefully no one said Wednesday because it's Sunday. And if you said Saturday, I might give that a pass since the live event did take place on that day. And subscribe before you go. Peace.